What's going on you nerds? We're back in another Neverwinter Nights video. Server hopping. We got two new servers to try out. Uh, I, I tried to uh, get some of these but it just wasn't working. Some needed CEP. Uh, if you have a suggestion for a server for me to try that is CEP, I'll, I'll probably do it as like a, you know, a separate video, like just CEP. Because I don't want to have to keep uh, putting it in, taking it out. That's definitely what... Uh, um, okay, so we're doing uh, this Loose server. Town of Loose is a story-driven action server that incorporates regenerative custom incantations. Check out those words. Uh, blah, blah, blah. We're going to try this out. And then the Time of Troubles Fallout. That sounds cool. Don't know anything about these servers, so we're going in cold turkey, whatever you want to call it. Oh, wow. The classes is only five. I chose a dwarf. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. But maybe there's just only five classes you can choose from. Anything else change? Did it always show these? Oh, wait, no, I think this is custom stuff. Oh! Fighters also receive feats automatically. Animal Companion? Luck of Hero Spring Attack. Oh my goodness, they get extra stuff at these levels. 25% chance to land an extra attack per round. What? Hold on. Clerics get Animal Companions. Turn Undead. They get a bonus feat at level 5 with Greater Wisdom. Greater Wisdom? What's Barbarian get? Animal Companion, Barbarian Rage, Damage Reduction. At level 2 you get Damage Reduction. Uh, can he dodge? Okay, this seems kind of normal. Ooh, resist energy cold, resist energy fire. That's pretty good. Man, look at the rogue stuff that you can get. Goodness gracious. Alright, here we go. Got a Dwarven Barbarian named Fifer Mater. Uh, just a, a random generated name. No way I would think of a name Fifer Mater on my own. Okay, so let's see. Guys, that the, the uh, class changes. The modifiers, that was uh, that was pretty cool. Wait, is this girl naked? Oh boy, might have to blur that out. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, they got a Discord channel. Why loose? Because we love NWM. We felt we wanted to implement new twists we haven't seen on other servers. Okay. Uh, they're meant to be quite challenging. Uh oh. Uh, resembling the fun games made in the '90s. Okay, got me. I was born in the '90s. I'm the epitome of a 90s kid because I was born on January 11th, 1990. I was 11 days into the 90s and I just shot right out of there into the world like a cannon. Okay, um, I don't, that was weird. Um, is this an RP server? Technically, no, but feel free to RP to your liking. There are no XP benefits for our, okay. All right, so RP not included. <laughs> it's like, it's like in a... You know, like a toy box. You know, uh, like sword not included, guns not included, RP not included. What skills do I need? One in disable trap and unlock would be helpful. Didn't do that. There are checks for all skills based on the situation, but it all depends on what kind of build you like to make. We recommend investing in concentration and heal skills. Every five must have minimum five for either one and these stack. Oh, nice. Increases the character's chance of getting back up after time. Oh! Okay, well, as a Barbarian, Concentration wasn't part of my uh, class skills, but Heal was. I didn't put 5 on Heal, though. You may vote to delay another... Whoa. It's going to restart in 5 minutes? Wait a minute. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, okay. well, that's not fair. Okay, let's just delay restart. Nice. All right. But I feel like a, I feel like a, a, a coder doing this. It slaughtered all my men, and I'm scared what it will do with their corpses. You don't want to be stuck here like me. You must go and slay that monster. What monster? Time portal? What is happening here? Wait, are we fighting here? I don't even have anything. What is going on? Book progression? Uh, so what's this time portal? I, I, don't, I don't know where to go. I'm pretty sure I'm going to die here. This doesn't seem... This doesn't seem good. What's going on here? 
Okay. Oh, I don't know what... Uh, what? Uh, what's happening? Okay, was I supposed to die? Well, it almost feels like you have lived this moment before. I don't know what's going on. What, what if I take the portal? What if ha what was going to happen? Let's go into the portal. I have been watching you with my aid. You may dematerialize your body and unify it back together at different locations throughout the land. Whoa. That's cool. Okay. They got portals. Pawn shop, Sergeant Ross Geller up in here. Let's see what David Schwimmer's up to. I have no jobs available at the moment. Come and see me in a, in a while. This guy's not taking no L's. No losses, because he didn't even add the L in available. Well, at least the other L. After... Wait, what? You must then be prepared to pay my overtime fees. Glenn! Oh, Jayan? Gayan? Jayan. Alright. What time is it right now? It's 4 o'clock in the morning. Alright. I guess I'll come back. At the end? Charisma. Wow, that's... Haven't heard of that before. Oh man, look at her. Our porch is just a f an iron fist. Oh man. That lady means business. We got some more giggles. We got Neki. Hello, Neki. Do you have any jobs for a lowly adventure? Yeah, sure. Try talking to si Silo. Silo. In the kitchen. Okay, I also remember seeking out Frago. Yeah, in the forest. Oh, she's winking at me. Alright, what does that mean? Okay, we got Beth. Looks exactly like Erebeth from the campaign. That is her. Uh, don't you think I'm the most beautiful creature you've seen? Uh, sh yeah, sure. Alright, that was it. Oh, here we go. Hours, see? 6 o'clock to 5 o'clock. Uh, Alright, so I guess he's... 6 o'clock, see? I told you. That's when the day starts. Oh, I'm looking for work. Man, the, this, the double space is throwing me off. I, I kind of like it. It makes it easier to read. I'm just so used to everything being single space, though. You are in luck. I need someone to find my missing flask. He looks quite upset. I know I left it somewhere down in the basement. I need it urgently. Be warned. There is a bit of an infestation down there, and these damn things are huge. If you think you can handle it, it would be much appreciated, mate. Okay, I... You know, seeing, uh, um, what was that name before? Okay, yeah, hold on. The, uh, these knives look sharp. What? That, that was such a weird... Oh, the waitress was following me. Um, so it's not that I saw Mate, and I saw Neki, because Neki sounds like a, an Australian kind of thing. Giving it a little, little Neki, you know? So it's something, something like that. New Zealand or Australian. I see, when I saw Mate... I'm like, oh yeah, that does kind of make sense now. Neki. Is there anyone named Neki out there that's watching this? Spelled exactly like that? And are you Australian or New Zealand? Er, New Zealander. Because I want to know. Alright, we got uh, the in rooms here. It's a crit key for. Oh, that's cool. Oh, what's this? What is that? They all have portals. Oh, we got some training here too. Oh, I like this. That's nice. I like the little touches, the subtle touches, you know, the little details in towns that make the world bigger or, you know, going out in the road. Anything like that, that kind of spruces up the place. I like it. All right, so do these pot helmets, oh, they do have armor bonuses. Okay. Lesser Gloves of Crafting. Paladin Helmet. Wow. Fighter Helmet. What do you get? Oh, okay. Large Shield. I only got 20 gold, so... I don't, I don't want to... Oh, what's this? Oh, his hammer. He's selling his hammer. 1d4 Piercing Damage. Only usable by Rogue. Oh, this guy's selling all his stuff. He's got his own sword, his own axe. Strength required 14. Oh, 
There's requirements. Okay, I got 16. That's good. Okay, let's see how these rats are. Hopefully, they, it, it's not like the other one where they just keep coming. I want enemies to stay dead until I get out of there. Oh, wow, okay. I thought this would be like, you know, really uh, dilapidated, but looks pretty clean. Are the rats just in rooms? Are they just chilling in rooms? Okay, no one's here. This feels a little bit like a zombie apocalypse. Oh, there's a rat. Oh, there's two, three rats. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Oh, Fiefer. Oh, na a natural 20? Come on now. Okay, Fiefer. Alright. Only got hit for one damage. That's, a, that's pretty good. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be trouble. Oh, man. This, these aren't one-hit kills. Oh, Fever might be going down. Oh, what? What was that? What was that effect? I have never seen that before. Actually, I've seen the effect before. I mean, I, like, I've never seen it for a dead... Signify something dead. A flask. Okay. Yeah, sure, I'll take it. Alright, got your flask. Somehow a rat a rat ate a flask? How small is this flask? Okay. Uh, Takes a big swig. Yo, this guy just drank something that came out of a rat? What else do you need? Go see Wariart at the barracks and give him this present from me. I was going to bring it to him myself, but we are quite busy at the moment. No one's in here, by the way. Uh, you might notice that he likes to be inspired as well. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, I, I like these little, you know, it, it's a quest. It's one quest that leads you to the next quest. I like that. Just less, less movement for me. Oh, there's more people here. Oh. Okay, yeah, I, I guess you guys are a little bit more busy. Hello, Morani. Just laughing again. People love to laugh in here. This city is full of laughs. Oh my god, having a jolly good time. This is great. This is Australia or New Zealand. I'm pretty sure, isn't it? Everyone's always having fun there. Okay, where a warrior? No descriptions. A little disappointing. But I guess it's not really a role-playing server anyway, so I guess you don't... You don't really need descriptions. Usually it's only for role-playing. I, I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, hey, what's up? Uh, chilled and aged wine. His tone completely changes in an instant and asks you to pour some in a dirty cup on his desk. Okay, any tasks? Cobalt problem. I did see the cave at the top of the map. Uh, increase in tax to the towns. Um, I know we do a lot of commons in meta, but you consider yourself lucky. These little bastards are constantly attacking our city gates and we need to find a way to slow them down. The cave is northwest of here. Sure. Oh! Wait, they changed the dexterity bonus. This was supposed to be two. They changed it to three. They changed this to three. This is the same. Oh, they added this. I think this is only one. Was it usually one or two? What about bandit mail? Whoa, they, ch yeah, they changed this. They are given a lot more challenge plate. Now this is the same. Only use about paladin. Oh, that's cool. Plate of light. Only by cleric. This is the same. This they uh, increase this by two. That's pretty good. I regret not making a fighter now, because I would be able to wear this. As a barbarian, I can't wear heavy armor. Pretty good. Looking real intimidating. Damn! Look at this guy. Whoo! Jeez, Santa Claus 2.0. Okay, let, let me just go rest. Can I just rest here? Oh! You may rest once again after one ticks. Each tick is 120 seconds in real time. So every two minutes you can rest. Uh, we got a, oh, a signpost. Loose outskirts west and east cobalt cave. 
East is not Cobalt Cave, by the way. That's north. Alright. I guess the... It's... Oh, yeah, the sign's not even right. Come on, guys. Okay. Uh, oh. Danger level 2. Uh-oh. I guess maybe I should have... Bought some healing. Okay, let's be smart about this. I'm gonna be smart. I'm gonna sneak up to him. Oh man, they don't they don't hear Fifer. Fifer got quiet footsteps. And then we pounce. We pounce. Oh my goodness. The first hit is a critical against me. Oh nice moves. I like how he looks, man. He looks pretty cool. You can imagine this guy in the, you know, uh, uh, the Hobbit, one of the dwarves. You have now calmed enough to rest. Oh, that's cool. Server's gonna be restarting in 30 minutes. Wow. I'm not sure why the restarting is so often. Like, what? Well, what is that? What? Well, what do you need to restart? Like, do the areas not respawn or something? Why? Why is it so often? People just like leaving stuff on the floor. That's making everything slower. Oh, just leveled. What do I get? Level 2. Oh, damage reduction. Okay. Cannot naturally take exotic weapon or heavy arm. Oh, I didn't see that. This looks important. This might be a, a boss. The Cobalt King is going to be here. Oh, there's a chest here. Uh-oh. It's the King's chest. Uh-oh. It's getting real. It's going to get real hyped here. Let's get him around the corner. And here comes the Cobalt King. I'm gonna show you who the real king is. Oh man, what a battle. This guy's sword is huge. Nice hit. Doing zero damage. Oh, he did one damage. I absorbed one, so he did two damage. I love this. Oh man. And I got some stuff. I got a rings, uh, gloves. Cobalt King's ear. Whoa. Guys, this is... This is great. Should I go back to, to this place? I guess I don't have to. Oh, you can use a key. Oh, keys that open chests. I rarely see that. Usually keys are like for doors. Wow. I'm pretty impressed with this, guys. Alright. Oh, wait, wait, where's the... Oh, my gosh. Is he gone already? It's 9 o'clock already? Oh, my goodness. No. Oh, it's got no sign. There's no sign here. Okay. That's interesting. Let's get armed. Alright, it's got to be some skeleton... Oh, here it is. Okay. Oh, danger level 3. Okay, makes sense. Hey, it's in ascending order of uh, danger level. What is that? The eerie air in here keeps you on edge. Oh, jeez, I just got cursed. What? I'm cursed as long as I'm in here? Oh my goodness. That's pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. That's terrible for me, but... You know what? It makes a lot of sense. I, hey, I'm gonna applaud that. My signature one applaud. All you need is one. I'm gonna keep my shield up as I'm running. I wish that was the thing I could do. Oh, I blocked it. Oh, I'm coming for you. Oh, oh, this guy has spells? Holy... Ah, recovery failed. Oh, oh it rolls a... Oh, it has a D20 on it. Okay. Oh, I, I probably should have read that screen. It said something. I lost 322 gold. Okay. Still got everything. I'm not sure if I lost experience. Alright. Hey, that's not a... It's not terrible. Guys, this is pretty good. The, for a server that has zero people majority of the time, and I have no idea what loose is, it's not bad. It's not terrible. So far, I'm going to give it a uh, 
7.7 out of 10. Pretty good. Pick up and play. Quick downloading to uh, for the files to play this. Got no qualms about this. Let me check out the road. Let me just see what the road is. Where does this go again? Outskirts. Oh, I thought it had an actual name. Okay. Well, let's see what the outskirts is like. Get my uh, hammer and shield out. Alright, not too bad. Oh. What? Who are you? Your bag feels heavier. Whoa, wait, hold on. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, I forgot I had all this stuff. Oh, crap. When you examine the rust on this old dagger, you realize it is in fact dried up blood. You become curious if this relates to the note you received from that scary hag who appeared out of thin air. Activate on self to cut your hand. Whoa. Hold on a second. Things just kicked up real fast. This suspicious note reads, I sense you will be interested in my proposition. Travel to the outskirts at night, to the special spot west of Luce, and your blood will help you reach me. Whoa. I did not expect anything like this to happen on the server. They have some secret scripting going on here. They had a special hag come at me and slip me a ceremonial dagger and an invitation. Wow, loose. Please, okay, well, the server's yelling at me to log out. Uh, yeah, this is pretty good. Uh, what was my, what was my, uh, what was my score? 8.2, 8.1? I'm just sticking with that. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. That was a pleasant surprise. Try this out, hey. Uh, oh, dynamic quests, random items, and epic boss battles. Hey, I got nothing to complain about this. Uh, try this out. That was, hey, that's pretty good. That's a great way to start off this video. Next up, the Time of Troubles Fallout. Ooh, they changed some stuff. Scion! Have unlocked hidden powers through the sheer force of their will. These innate abilities were lost during the Troubles. Would have been rediscovered recently by Scions and Psionic creatures alike. A scion uses the same weapons as a thief and selects an area of psionic to specialize in. Whoa. Race is allowed? Whoa. Guys. Wow. Diplomacy? Is that always here? I don't think so. That might be new. Auto hype. Oh, auto hypnosis. I was going to say auto-hypothesis. I'm like, you know, that's definitely not the right. Auto-hypnosis. Probably for the Scions. Whoa. Whoa, they're giving me extra stuff here. Hold on. They're giving me exotic by default. Trackless steps. Yeah, that's normal. Save tool. Keen sense. They're giving me knockdown already? Wait a minute. Why are they giving me so much stuff? Let's try this out. I'm gonna guess this is a heavily RP focus. This room is where your customization feats will be applied to your character. If you are ex if you are experience, uh, what? If you are experience a gnome dwarf experience bug, a uh, gnome dwarf appearance bug, log out. Okay. Characters on the time of troubles. Fallout starts at level three. All of your first three classes must be the same. Afterwards, dual classing rules apply for humans, and multi classing apply for demi humans. Demi humans. Uh, following rules apply to human characters who wish have more than one class. In order to qualify for a second character class, a character must possess an attribute score of 17 in the primary attribute of the new class. Oh, wow. This is not possible to dual class into the druid class as druids must have the specialty priest kit. What is happening here? Henchman control. Oh, they have henchman control tool. Oh, nice. I always like this, where you can like manually control, you can point and click to where you want your henchmen to go. That's always good. Okay, let's try this out. Welcome to the Time of Troubles Fallout server. We hope you enjoy your stay. In order to better accommodate your character, we've created options that will allow all the DMs, or that will allow the DMs in game to properly portray your place in the world. Uh, sub race, ethnicity, class standing, background, deity, language, proficiencies. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, man. You can choose different... Oh, wow. Okay, I like this. 
a dark elf is a drow. I don't. Uh, I'm not really a. I don't want to be a drow on the surface right now. Copper, silver. Maybe silver elf. That sounds cool. Okay, let's go silver. Oh, it gives you the descriptions too. The most common sort of elves in Faerun, also called moon elves. Uh, blah blah blah. blah. These elves are a minority in Tethyr and might be regarded as soft or alien by the copper and green elves. Wow. Okay, what about dark elves? Dark elves are cursed to the also called the drow. They have black skin and resembles... Oh, ECL plus two? Oh, they got effective class levels. They are distinguished easily by their bearing. This can be a disadvantage since the interreg... Oh, whoa. Man, I've never seen that word before. You stumped me. A uh, kit represents a very specific training possessed by a character and cannot be changed. Oh, I like this. I like this. Arcane archers must come from the ranks of elves. They can begin their careers as wizards, rangers, or fighters. Once they begin training in wizard levels, will their abilities fully manifest? They receive plus two discipline and spellcraft skills, a character re uh, generation, and receive an additional plus one each of these skills within every five. Okay, okay, level seven, they receive seeker arrows. And 11th, they receive hail of arrows. Arcane archers automatically receive proficiency with the longbow and short. Oh, that's nice. Uh, wow. How about this wild talent? Who have some limited psionic ability, but who have another class, uh, character class other than scion. That's not me. Spellfire channeler. Uh, in indiscriminate nature of the gods bestowing their special talent. A spell fire channel or gains a plus two bonus to concentration skills at any or at character generation receive blah blah blah. A spell fire channel resists fire damage, shrugs off hostile magic, and absorbs magical power from magical places, spells targeted on the person. Whoa. If she uses a spells or potions, a spell fire channel can do so even in dead magic areas or wild magic zones. What? Wow. That's not me, but that sounds cool. I'm going to be Arcane Archer. Oh, we got languages now. Oh, man. Guys, this is pretty cool. Undercommon, Rashimi, Orkish, Mulhorundi, Infernal, Illuskin, Halfling, Gnomish, Dwarven, Duger, Damarin, Chondathan, Abyssal. Maybe Orkish? Elves and Orcs, you know, they're always fighting each other. Maybe they picked up on some of the languages. What the hell is it? Arquebus? Cav... Cavalier? Pistol? Whoa, wait a minute. Oh, so that's why they gave me... What proficiency for all of this? Because, like, it has its own separate... Like, proficiency list. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. Gunsmithing? Oh, yeah, there's, so there are guns here. You have a working knowledge of smoke powder weapons. You can create smoke powder weapons from base crafting materials as well as modify smoke powder weapons with exceptional properties. Whoa! Hold on a second. Performance, mycology, masonry, tracking, trap setting. Jeez! What is going on here? Okay, so I guess that's everything. That was crazy. Just that setup alone was... Oh, it changed. Silver Elf. Guys, I like this. I got a kit, the Arcane Archer kit, Elemental Arrow. It's a placeholder, class standing. Wow. I'm impressed. Oh, man, this looks so cool. No description on it. Oh, here it is, the Ar Ar Archibus. Jeez. You're going to have a sniper in this game. Look at this. Rest cannot take place under especially poor weather. Can it? Wow. Uh, better quality tent provide. Wow, this is crazy. They got different quality tents. What is that? Armor, slow character movement. Well, worn druids cannot wear metal armor, but they can use shields. Uh, armor, shields, helmets, and bracers reduce the likelihood of extra penalties when the wearer is the recipient of a critical hit. Oh, what? Getting critical hit has more effects on you? The time of troubles has just come to an end. Oh, it's just the end of it? Oh, oh! I thought. Oh, f I guess that makes sense. Time of Troubles Fallout. I thought it was in the. We're in the middle of it. 
Oh, that kind of changes things. Lycan throw. Oh, we can be a lycan. I'm liking that you can be a lycan. Guys, holy jeez. Okay, so I was. Oh, this is a great picture. Wow, you see that? Okay, as I was saying, the time of troubles. Oh wow, dragonfly. The time of troubles was a time in the like forgotten realms, you know, universe, where all of these gods got uh, like sent down to Earth, which is like here. It's not really called Earth. It's a uh, Toril, I think it's called, and. Uh, the main god, like the god of all gods, was like, "Hey, you, you, a couple of guys did something wrong, and then they're like, you know what? I'm gonna put you all in Toril, so you can be with all of your followers, all of your worshippers, as punishment, because three guys, or like someone stole these tablets, that are like really important tablets, and the main god was like, who the hell took these? No one's confessing it, so let me just send you all down as punishment." So all of the gods went down to Earth and basically just had to live normal lives. And it was scarier for them because they didn't have any of the god powers. So they could actually die if they were down there. When for the most part, if they were in heaven or hell, they were like immortal. And there was like a lot of fighting going on. Gods killed other gods. Some regular people became gods. It was kind of crazy. That's the gist of the story. So I thought we were going to be in the midst of this like you're gonna see gods you're gonna be fighting other gods and stuff but apparently this is the end of that era and all the gods have already ascended or descended so uh, I'm I'm less interested in this now because it's at the tail end and also during that time when all the gods were on the uh, look at this moose by the way at, at the time where all of these gods were on earth um, people couldn't be using any magic I just Animal empathy, this moose. Oh, man. As a Canadian, I love this. Um, anyways, when all the gods were on this earth, uh, a lot of magic wasn't working because magic usually flows through your deity, your god. And since none of the gods were in the heaven or hells, all the, go or the, all the magic went wild. Called wild magic, or there was just no magic that worked at all. So it was super hectic in this world during the Time of Troubles. One of my favorite times uh, in this game, uh, but I'm a little disappointed. Wow, this is so cool. I've never seen this before. The ancient, spelled ancient wrong, looking stone appeared as though it had been well maintained until recently. I have never seen this before. They carved a giant soldier in the wall like that. Where'd you get that tile? I want that. Let me get the gun out. Wait, I need more base attack modifier to equip that. Wait, no, no. Oh my gosh. Critical, wow, what is this? Critical severity is nine, critical resistance is five. You equip scimitar and gain a plus one defending bonus from parry. Guys, this is insane. There is like so much extra stuff here. My guy looks kind of cool though. Oh wait, I can I can test out this henchman tool. So I can click on him. Oh wait, is that the right? Oh, sorry, that's F10. Meaning moose. And now he's moving. Check that out. Nice. I like it. Guys, this is the server surprising me more and more. Wait, do I have? Can't I get a summon? I could have sworn a summon was one of the options. Defensive casting, no. Crafting skills. Mount actions, sub race. What is all this stuff? Call for help? Oh, here we go. Call for help tool. Choose from the options below. Horses, golems, any events you want to display here. Bannerman, Bannerman. Summons misc. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, give me a, a wolf. No, I got a wolf. What? Oh, this is crazy. Can I get another one? Oh, no, I can't. What about a horse? Wow. Call henchman. 
Man, I got a wolf. I can command him. Let's chase the squirrel. I'll have him chase the squirrel. He's having fun. Okay, time to come back to me, wolf. We got a traveling trader. What is going on here? Hello, sir. I like the tattoos. This guy's not even going to talk to me. What's going on here? All right. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, yeah, he doesn't have anything to say. All right, what's up, guys? The wolf is mine. Don't do anything to the wolf. I love these the thumbnails, by the way, those little loading screen pictures. This is great. We've got a camel here. Oh, wow. Man, the design, the map design is pretty good. What's here? Man, what is this place? The castle walls. The Teje the Teharn? The Teharn Gate? Tethia Road? Oh, I just realized. Oh my gosh, you got temperature, humidity, wind. What is... They have humidity, temperature, and wind. What is going on here? Sprin Sprindel Star, Joaquin. Waning half moon. The hot air is miserable, causing you to sweat excessively. A steady breeze of warm air blows across the county. Holy. They have so much extra stuff here. Okay, so this is a... T are we in Tethier? No, we're still on the road. We're in the inner courtyard. Bounty collector. Oh my gosh, they even have pictures. Wow. Wanted for kidnapping. Wanted for fraud. Who is this guy? That's a creature? What is this? Holy jeez. Ask about purchasing supplies. Oh, okay. Iron gauntlets. Iron shield. Okay, a lot of iron stuff. Got a crossbow. Low quality tent. Oh, a wood axe. Oh, interesting. A brazier. Traveling sack. Oh, it's got a uh, weight reduction. That's nice. Uh, okay. Whoa, that's nice. Patricka. Was a potent yet sweet wine made in Kalamshan. I like it. I like the description. I have said it before. The descriptions are always important. Do you guys have descriptions? See? These guys got descriptions. Although really minimal, but, you know, it's better than nothing. Look at this guy. Alright, he's busy. I love this how this guy looks, though. This guy looks badass. What else do we got here? Oh, wait, there's stairs down here. Uh-oh. Are going to be rats here? Let's try it out. Oh, wow. Guys, this looks pretty cool. Like, I've never seen some of these tile sets before. They got their own sound effects. Oh, man. Great designs. I don't know why it's pure white here. That's weird. Oh, a tunnel. What the... Whoa. Guys, this is cool. Doing exploring and I'm already finding hidden stuff. Maybe this is the path of Tehar or path of Tethir. Coal deposit. I guess you need a pickaxe for that. Small spider. Not hostile. A little surprising. Looks like we got an exit up here. Oh, we're back on the road. Teharn Mines. Property of the Lord of Teharn Gate. Oh, jeez. There's a... Oh, my gosh. Oh, we're in trouble. Uh, Is there going to be like a queen spider here? Oh, my gosh. Look at the effects. Wow. This is pretty impressive. The, the webs just went away. It's like going away and coming back. 
Maybe it's because I'm a, I'm a ranger? Is that what it is? That they're not attacking me? Because if so, that's pretty cool. I'm just going to say that it is. Oh, we got a bandit here. A lone man trying his luck on travelers braiding the Tethyr Road. Descriptions are pretty nice. The descriptions are pretty nice. Sim plain and simple. They spell H. I guess they don't. Yeah, there's a lot of ancients spelling uh, miscorrectly. You cannot damage a foe from so far away. Oh, crap. Uh, okay, switch. Oh! My armor blocks 3 damage. The enemy's armor blocks 4 damage. Wow. This is... Holy jeez. I love this. Oh my gosh. You can get the heads of bandits for a bounty? What is... Jeez. How does this crafting work? Uh, okay, well, I got nothing. Place a wood resource in the crafting box to begin. Is this the crafting box? It's the crafter's box. Is that the same? I don't know. Okay, hey. They got crafting, though. I like that. This is... I, I don't really know what to give this score. It's... I got so invested in just the character creation, I barely had any time to play on the server. But just from these like two to three areas that I've been to already, I like it. I don't know if I can give it like a 9 out of 10 because I just, I wasn't here enough. But I might give it like an 8.5 maybe? Oh wow, look at this. Does this not remind you of that scene in the old Mortal Kombat when... Scorpion and a uh, thing are fighting in the forest. Got an oak tree. Can you cut these down? Is that why this is? Since you are not proficient in wood gathering, you're unable to collect this resource. Wow. I can really imagine a lot of players being like, Hey, I'm looking for a carpenter. Uh, can you chop down some trees for me or whatever and make this bow? Like, there's, I feel like there's a lot of uh, interaction with people that are specialized in certain skills, you know? That's great. That... Helps the community a lot. A lot more interaction between players and characters. It's great, man. It's great. They did their homework. Whoever made this. Oh, there's a snake. Whoa. The village of Brost. Here we are. We're walking in like a cool guy. On saddle. Uh, on uh, horseback. With my wolf. With no body. Like a cool guy. Hello, county militia. Ross Caravan Sarai. Guys, this is this is great. I got no complaints about this. You gotta try this out. I guess if you're not a big uh Ooh, we got a marker here. I guess if you're not a big role playing guy, maybe this won't appeal to you, because I feel like uh You know, it's not just gonna be like crazy fighting here like that other server. But hey, if it, like the stuff that you can explore, the stuff you can look at. Look look at this. They have this like little glowing stuff. What is that? I don't even know what that is. But I like it. We got campfire here. Some county militia. Bring some friends over and just have some fun around the campfire. The rangers rest. Look at look at this. This is beautiful. Let me hop off here. Let's just take a look inside before we uh before we go. Mail bail. Mail bin. Wow, this is great. Ask about Mailiki. Okay, hey, I'm a ranger too. You know me. Uh okay. Not there's not too much dialogue it seems like, but that's okay. Look at the design though. Look at this. Oh, he's just oh he's got selling stuff. I don't know why this white background is like that. That should probably be fixed. Never seen these bracers before. Mandrake root. Oh man, playing this back to back. Mandrake. This is beautiful. Shady figure. Oh, wait a minute. What is this? Why are you in, Why are you back here? Oh, it's a bank. 
Uh, oh, the, even the coin is named Zero Anar. Okay. Shady figure. I don't like how you're standing in the corner of a room where the bank is. Not your banner, but sword work is honest at least. Okay. Uh, shall we stop it there? This is... Guys. Can't say this enough. I, I am impressed. Let's get the rumors. Oh. There are roles for rumors. You need a, dis a diplomacy check. Wow. This is really true to form, like D and D stuff. Like they have roles for like almost everything. I love the weather updates. Man, this this is like close to like hardcore D and D stuff. Like if you don't really like the role playing D and D aspect of it, I don't know if this is gonna be for you. But if you are into that stuff, this is this is impressive. This is really impressive. Now I did say this. I did say that only playing an hour in this, for all I know, you know, like the further you go, maybe just like nothing to do at a certain point. But like as a new player, this is. Look at this. This is great. Nine. Oh no, not nine. What was it? Let's see. Eight point six. Eight point six out of ten. This is beautiful. Nothing bad to say about this. This is great. I got a wolf with me. I can control him. The controlling thing. Maybe 8.7 because you can control companions. 8.7 out of 10. This is wonderful. Try this out if you're a big, you know, D&D kind of guy. And you want to maybe uh, find out about some lore of the Time of Troubles. I don't know if they do have any lore stuff, but you never know. Uh, 8.7. I love it. Guys, this is this was a great day for server hopping. Let's check out these servers again. We got the Time of Troubles Fallout. Uh, and uh, Loose. Two underrated servers, honestly, guys. Very underrated. Try them out. That's another episode of Server Hopping. Thank you guys so much for watching. That was, that was fun. If you have any suggestions of servers for me to try, leave a comment down below. Appreciate it. Until next time. Peace out, you nerds.